<sighs> Good morning, YouTube. How's everybody doing? I got a story to tell you. For the for those that know, I got fired on my day off, and I've been trying to like get this guy back. Okay, and so I didn't get my last check. Now, this is the new outcome. Basically, he gave me my check finally, my last pay, but did not sign the check. But get this, I called him and told him he needs to sign the check. You know what he tells me? He says, it's my company. I'm giving you permission to sign my check. I told him I cannot sign your check because that's against the law. And then he uh, proceeds to say, are you stupid or are you dumb? I'm giving you permission to sign my check because I'm not writing no more checks. He said, I'm not writing no more checks. I'm not cash apping you. So if you want your money, you got to sign my name to get your check. So now I reached out to a lawyer because if I'm not mistaken, and I want y'all to comment back, isn't that fraud because that's his check? But he's saying because it's his company and he's giving me permission to sign his name, I can do that. I don't think I can do that. And I don't think I want to do that. You know, it's just like he's just been a real fucked up ass jerk. Like I said, he fired me on my day or now he don't want to sign my damn check. You know, it's he's just doing too much. Like, for real, he's just doing too much. And um, it's pissing me off, like, really. <sighs> so I did call, contact these people called uh, Mila or something like that. I think it's uh, somebody gave me another firm company. Um... Because, like I, as I said, a 1099 worker, they could fire you. But I didn't do nothing wrong. I got fired on my day off. That's number one. Then I reached out to him and I was like, can I get my last pay? My last pay, but I got it, but he won't sign a damn check. I went to the check cash place. She was like, I can't, it's a problem. I can't, I can't cash this because it's not signed. I'm like, okay. So I call him and tell him to sign the check and he's like he's not signing the check the check is signed automatically it don't need to be signed i'm like who does that what the fuck so i'm like maybe this man maybe it's this first time having a company or he don't know shit about what the fuck he's supposed to be doing so i contact him again and tell him that his bank where the check came from says that you need to sign the check so he says once again like this I'm going to say this again and let you hear this clearly. I am giving you permission to sign my check because I am not writing another check. I'm like, wow. So I really want y'all to please comment down below. What the hell do you think that I should do? Should I sue him or what? Because I believe that I can. And I believe that I got him down as trying to make me commit fraud. I might be wrong, but I'm not doing that shit. So, yeah. And I got the screenshots of what he texts me, all our, our conversations. And if I got to go through a lawyer, because he already threatened me one time when I was like, you know, it was against the law when unemployment said it was against the law for him to fire me. Then he was like, oh, you're a 1099 worker, so yes, I can fire you. You fired me on my day off when I wasn't working, but yeah, you can fire me. But then I talked to this person this morning, and he was like, you need to talk to Neela and see if somebody, you get in, they'll get in contact with you, and then take it from there, because maybe you, you probably do have a case now that he's being an asshole and don't want to sign a check. So, I don't know. But yeah, that's that's what's going on. So I just had to come tell y'all this bullshit. <laughs>